information. Your business cannot function without it. Yet you have an information problem you may not even be aware of, and it's affecting your productivity. Today's businesses do not lack the information necessary to perform the work. The problem comes in locating, obtaining, refining, and using it. Then, communicating the information to others efficiently. What is needed is a control mechanism to provide manageable channels for this information flow. A channel that also provides a framework for integrating the separate disciplines needed to work on this information. At the DataPoint Corporation, we are committed to helping business become more productive through better information management. Our focus is on the office, and we have more than a decade of experience, including such milestones as the user-oriented mini-computer, dispersed data processing, voice communications management systems, the coaxial cable-based local network, and electronically integrated office functions accessible from a single multifunction workstation. With these elements forming the necessary framework for office integration, DataPoint introduces the vital connection for present and future office integration. The DataPoint ISX, Information Switching Exchange. The DataPoint ISX is a tremendously powerful third-generation digital PPX whose capabilities and benefits establishes a new standard for computerized switching exchanges. Power. The power to switch thousands of simultaneous calls without blocking. Modularity. The dispersed switching architecture of the ISX system allows you to configure a system with the instruments and switching units you need located where you need them. Expandability. A data point commitment enabling you to start with as few as 100 user stations and then expand your system to over 20,000 stations. Flexibility. You select the features you need from the vast array of options provided by the system adding, deleting, and modifying system and user options as desired. Accountability, providing you with a detailed account of system usage to optimize performance and bill back usage cost. Usability, computerized telephones and inexpensive multifunction terminals designed to help you do your work, not make more. Reliability, Internal testing programs, remote diagnostics, and a highly trained data point service force ensures maximum performance, minimizing downtime. Integration. Inexpensive three-pair universal wiring carries all forms of digitized information, voice, data, text, and messages, easily integrating all these functions today, ready for additional functions in the future. All of these benefits of the DataPoint ISX were developed to improve the efficiency of your business on both the individual and corporate level, while providing significant cost savings through a system as large and as sophisticated as you want. The primary components of the DataPoint ISX are the switching process control subsystems, consisting of the central switching unit and one or more remote switching units, the data management subsystem, and the telephone instruments and multifunction terminals which provide your interface to the ISX system. The central switching unit, CSU, is the heart of the system. It consists of a cabinet containing a modular assembly of printed circuit boards with programs that perform central switching, control, call processing, and external control functions for the system. The CSU is controlled by several 16-bit microprocessors physically associated with the program memory while capable of accessing a common memory of up to 8 megabytes. This tremendous processing power allows the DataPoint ISX to switch more than 12,000 simultaneous calls. Because voice communications is switched by the system as digitized information, a larger volume of information can be handled at higher speeds. Not only does the DataPoint ISX switch digitized voice communication, but data, text, electronic messages, and all other forms of digitized information. This capability alone transcends the usual PBS features of the system, allowing it to truly function as an information switching exchange. Your interface to the system for telephone instruments and terminal workstations and local switching is accomplished at remote sites by remote switching units. You may configure the DataPoint ISX with up to 60 RSUs, 
each unit supporting up to 350 voice or data ports, expanded in eight port increments. Information destined for an area beyond the local RSU is switched through the central switching unit. This is called dispersed switching. One of the many important benefits of a dispersed switching architecture is the offloading of the CSU through local switching at the RSU level. The expandability of your ISX system is another benefit of this architecture. Selecting only the switching power needed for the present affords you substantial cost advantages while providing an avenue for growth as your requirements change. With dispersed switching, RSUs may be physically located in different rooms, on different floors, or in completely different buildings from the CSU. The ability to physically separate or disperse these remote units is accomplished through a variety of interswitch links. An RSU supporting a number of communications ports within the same building as the CSU will be linked via coaxial cable. If your RSUs are located in different buildings of an office park where the laying of cable could prove to be cost prohibitive, data points light link will bridge the gap. Light link is an optical data link utilizing infrared light to transmit digital information over distances of up to one mile. For remote units situated further than one mile from the central unit, microwave may be used as an interswitch link. Performing the administrative chores of the ISX system is the data management subsystem. This subsystem is the means by which you may add, delete, or modify the optional parameters for the system, as well as individual users. Through the DMS, you may change the service features assigned to any telephone or data station on the system. Features such as line restriction, assigned user priority, and the addition or deletion of telephone instrument options. The DMS allows the user to modify system features, such as rearranging extension numbers, or implementing a custom least cost routing table to optimize the use of long distance lines during heavy usage periods. The reporting function of the data management system supplies detailed information on system usage, enabling the user to fine tune system operation. Accounting information provided by the DMS allows the user to bill back all line and facility usage by division, department, and individual. The information provided by the data management system gives you the means to achieve the maximum performance out of your ISX system for minimum cost. All the benefits offered by the data point ISX are not strictly at the system level. A variety of industry standard telephones are compatible with the ISX system, but in DataPoint's commitment to deliver the technology necessary to improve efficiency, the InfoSet 1 and InfoSet 2 heighten the benefits the ISX system has to offer. InfoSet 1 is a digital push-button dial single-line instrument. In addition to the standard dialing pad, the InfoSet 1 has four special feature buttons, simplifying functions such as call holding, call transfer, pickup, and conference calling. DataPoint's InfoSet 2 is an executive-oriented telephone instrument which utilizes a combination of standard and programmable function keys, a 24-character alphanumeric display, and internal speaker phone for hands-free operation. Both sets provide the station user with a wide variety of features beyond call holding, conference calling, and transferring. Automatic callback will ring back a station once the call line is free. A user may program personal speed numbers, local or long distance, for frequently called numbers. For the user needing a terminal workstation, a data service unit provides an RS-232 connection to data, text, and message information available through the system. This ability to interface both telephone and data stations directly into your PBX with three-pair universal house wiring is a major breakthrough in the integration of these office functions. But beyond the technological importance of this capability is the cost savings to you. One system, one information line for data processing programs, file access, word processing, and electronic message traffic requirements. Its modular design makes it simple to install additional terminals, and the extensibility of the DataPoint ISX system provides the avenue needed for future electronic office introductions. A DataPoint 8200 non-intelligent terminal configured on the ISX system accesses the desired functions from a DataPoint 8800 or other processor on the same or different RSU.
The multiprocessing and partitioned logic capabilities of the DataPoint 8800 and RMS operating system allows the 8200 to take full advantage of all automated office functions. In areas where heavy processing power is required, an accounting department, for example, a processor on an ARC local network will supply the processing power and facilities necessary. If you choose, you may elect to pool your data ports on the same RSU, increasing the cost effectiveness of their use. Because a telephone system of any size requires an attendant operator, the DataPoint ISX has provided a truly innovative instrument in its attendant console. A standard DataPoint video display terminal with additional function keys, a push-button dialing pad and headset gives the attendant complete control over several simultaneous calls. Directory assistance and station busy indication are integrated into the terminal's display. This console informs the attendant of the specific status of a busy line, on hold in conference, whether the call is an internal or external one. A communication system capable of handling all an office's information transactions cannot afford downtime. At DataPoint, we understand this, so we have designed a full range of unique maintenance features into the ISX system. Self-diagnostic maintenance procedures in each RSU, as well as the CSU, continually monitor the system's operation. If a problem occurs in one of the switching units, the faulty circuit board is isolated, electronically disconnected, and a spare backup board is immediately brought up. Typically, this entire process occurs in milliseconds without interruption to calls in progress. Once this board had been electronically replaced, the ISX automatically initiates a diagnostic report to DataPoint's National Service Center and prints a report showing which customer site, type of system, specific cabinet, which card cage, board in that cage, the type of board, and the revision level of the fail board. The system will also alert the attendant and the company's communications manager of the problem through the data management subsystem reporting function. If the ISX detects an error beyond the simple replacement of a circuit board, the ISX automatically contacts the DataPoint National Service Center and opens a line for the center to perform remote diagnostics on the system. With the options you select and the parameters you set, the ISX system frees you from the overcapacity or undercapacity trap found in other telecommunications systems. To some, the DataPoint ISX will appear a very powerful PBX but its full integration of voice, text, data, and message services transcends the PBX category and marks the emergence of the information switch. In the future, the capabilities of the DataPoint ISX will accommodate explosive growth and incorporate additional functions and features, making it an even more dynamic system. Rather than becoming obsolete, through innovative information switching features, the system purchased now will provide even greater cost and work-saving office applications for the next decade and on into the future. communications. Most of today's small to medium-sized telephone systems, 10 to 100 stations, just can't offer your business the sophisticated features and the economic benefits provided to large companies by sophisticated PBX-operated phone systems. Features which would provide you with direct cost savings. Cost savings through features such as call forwarding, call transferring, call conferencing, and call waiting by improving the interaction of user and system providing a more efficient work environment. These features, these benefits to your business were only available on a few extremely expensive EPABX systems until the introduction of the DataPoint KSX, Key Switching Exchange. The DataPoint KSX is a sophisticated stored program digital key system designed for those offices where versatility and growth potential are essential. 
The data point KSX provides 8 to 128 user stations with a sophisticated full-featured telephone key system that solves everyday user problems inherent in conventional key systems. Line access, handset pickup, a single line intercom, calls waiting, call transfer, 7 to 10 digit dialing. Eliminating these inefficient telephone operations is reason enough to consider the data point KSX. But ease of use is not the only benefit it provides. Many executives today believe the price of telecommunications is simply a fact of business life. The system is necessary, so they pay the price. DataPoint has changed a lot of that kind of thinking with our communications management products, which provide the user with detailed cost per call information and the other needed data to help you reduce your overall telephone costs. Our commitment to optimizing your telephone system is the truly unique benefit of the KSX. Direct cost savings stem from your ability to restrict line usage and curb abuse. Flexibility through modular design allows you to configure the size system you need now, eliminating costly station additions and system expansion. System downtime is substantially reduced through DataPoint's ability to perform remote diagnostics and database maintenance. Finally, the DataPoint KSX provides an optional call detail reporting output that can supply you with system usage data to further control cost. How can such a small system provide you with so many benefits? Let's examine the components of the KSX. At the heart of the system is the microprocessor controlled key service unit, KSU. The printed circuit card architecture of the KSU allows the user to configure the size system needed while allowing for the future addition of stations and lines when needed. The key service unit's microprocessor controls station operation, memory access, and system peripherals. A non-volatile memory card stores the system's programs and any individual customer-defined options. A digital time division switch card assures the user sophisticated high-speed switching characteristics. Station circuit cards each support up to eight telephone instruments for a system total of 128 stations. Trunk circuit cards control up to four trunk lines each, allowing for a maximum of 32 trunks. 24 of these may be two-way office lines and eight one-way lines for outgoing calls. The simple addition of station or trunk cards allow the user to expand his system incrementally as more facilities are required. The KSX is designed to support up to 80 Keyset 24 computerized telephones, with the remainder being electronic single-line instruments. The Keyset 24 is a push-button telephone controlled by an internal microprocessor with 24 line buttons and four special function keys plus the standard dialing pad. These user-oriented stations provide a full array of features such as a hands-free speakerphone, two and three-digit intercom dialing, and ten user programmable personal speed numbers. The special function keys allow the user the options of call transferring, call conferencing, call forwarding, automatic redialing, and the speakerphone. The telephone operator for your office will be able to direct calls more efficiently with the direct station selection unit. The DSS unit consists of 60 station buttons and attaches directly to the attendant's Keyset 24. This unit allows the operator to tell at a glance which extension is in use and allows for the transfer of any incoming call at the push of a button. Three-pair universal wiring and modular jacks allow for simple installation, replacement, and upgrading of instruments. Let's take a practical look at its operation. The KSX not only provides access to external lines or central office lines, but supports a truly user-engineered intercom network. To access the intercom of the KSX, all you need to do is go off hook and the intercom is ready. There is no intercom key. If you wish to speak with a coworker, enter a two or three digit intercom number, and the system will automatically select one of eight available intercom paths and complete the call. At the receiving end, a distinctive audible ringing tone indicates an incoming intercom call. If the party chooses, the incoming call may be answered hands-free through the station's speakerphone capability. A microphone indicator lamp on the set will indicate a call taken in the hands-free mode. 
During any intercom or any external office call, the user has the ability to go back and forth between the handset and speakerphone operation. If, during the course of the conversation, another intercom call is made to the extension in use, an audible and visual signal is received indicating a call is waiting. If the call is not immediately accepted, it may be placed on a call waiting queue. If the originator elects, which will automatically call back his extension when the called party becomes available. Consultation hold is another user-oriented feature of the KSX. By pressing the hold key, another extension may be called or an external call may be made over a central office line. Once this call is completed, the call on hold will be automatically reconnected. This feature stems from the system's ability to utilize all lines available to the station. The flexibility of this user-oriented intra-office communications capability of the KSX frees users from the limitations and annoyances of more conventional single-line intercom systems. This same flexibility applies to external office communication. A user wishing to place an external call need only select one of the line keys and dial a number. If all lines available to the user are occupied, the caller may elect to have the KSX automatically ring back the station when the line becomes free. If a called number is busy, it may be automatically redialed simply by pressing a function key. Conference calling, an important benefit for any company, is accomplished easily by pressing a function key. This enables two individuals in an office to talk to an outside caller or two external callers to conference with one individual. One of the most unpredictable features of a conventional telephone system is call transferring. The data point KSX allows any outgoing or incoming call to be transferred to a different extension. By the same method, an incoming call may be transferred and placed on hold at the extension. If a transfer call is not answered in a specific user-defined time limit, it will automatically ring back to the extension that made the transfer. A call transferred to a specific extension, ringing or on hold, may be transferred onto yet another extension if needed. This transferability is a real benefit to users when routing calls to specific individuals on the system. But what if an individual is not at his extension? The KSX provides the options of internal and external paging and a message center. Internal paging allows the user to segment his office in up to six zones. By entering a code on a dedicated key set, any or all non-active stations in these zones will be paged through the station's speakerphone. Dan, line A. Normally, a telephone system's operator will collect messages for the people on the system. But with the KSX, a separate message center with a dedicated extension may be established if desired. A special function key on a user's set will flash if a message is waiting for him at the center. A user on the system need only press the function key to access the center and retrieve his message. The KSX was developed to work for you, not against you. Stations may be customized to suit the current needs of the user, with features that range from adjustable ring and paging volume controls to more sophisticated features which enable you to turn off your phone when you don't wish to be disturbed. The ability to add, delete, or modify specific features of a station enables you to tailor your office communication system exactly to your needs. During installation, trained data point personnel will configure your KSX with the operating features best suited to your specific requirements. Line restrictions, call detail information, paging zones, extension assignment, recall times, and many other options are not limited to your system's initial configuration. As your requirements change, so may the KSX, and without interruption of service. Diagnostic test programs performed remotely on the KSU by trained data point service representatives quickly locate any defective element in the system. By opening a telephone line directly to data point's national service center, system reliability is ensured by prompt maintenance action, thus eliminating extensive system downtime. DataPoint's nationwide network of highly trained sales and service personnel are ready to supply the support necessary to keep your system operating at peak performance, 24 hours a day, 365 days a year, anywhere in the nation. The KSX, Key Switching Exchange, is part of a family of DataPoint telecommunications products that cover the full range of business needs. 
For larger and more sophisticated requirements, the Datapoint ISX can meet the total information switching needs of any medium to large company. Capable of supporting 100 to 20,000 telephones or video display terminals, the ISX provides a channel for all forms of digital information. Voice, data, text, messages, and more. Modular architecture, simplified installation, and computerized control work together to provide any small to medium-sized business with a sophisticated, expandable, custom-designed, and cost-effective key system. To the KSX user, the availability of the Datapoint ISX offers the benefit of an economical, nearly limitless growth path. office, an integral part of today's business and a vital link in business communications. Every day, thousands of bits of information flow through the average office. On the outside, it appears to operate efficiently enough. But let's take a closer look. The office of today is non-integrated. In other words, people and pieces of equipment function separately instead of as an integrated or coordinated unit. The result? Higher operating costs, communications breakdowns, and loss of managerial control. While productivity in the factory has increased 84% in the last 10 years, office productivity has shown a rise of only 3%. Key factors in this are a lack of mechanization, poor office systems integration, and lack of relevant management information. The goal of communications management is to tackle these problems. When the computer entered the business world in the 50s, a major step toward increased office efficiency was made. However, the traditional computer lacked flexibility, both economically and in terms of users' ease of operation. What was needed was a cost-efficient system that could be deployed throughout a business where users could benefit. With that as an objective, Datapoint Corporation designed its product family modularly, which resulted in the development of ARC, the Attached Resource Computer, the most flexible solution to the problems of conventional computer systems today. By Datapoint's marriage of its InfoSwitch communications management products with ARC, the reality of merging voice and data is achieved. InfoSwitch ARC allows for growth without interruption, without extensive operator retraining, and without costly upgrading of existing systems. It is a system built to beat the system, one that is adaptable to your budget instead of the other way around. Datapoint, the leader in dispersed data processing, has taken the lead in communications management today addressing the problems inherent in today's businesses and providing solutions that cut costs and increase management control. As we look at the possibilities of integrating office systems, let's first look at the development of voice communications management. The problem was apparent. Corporate telecommunications costs were skyrocketing and management did not have the information needed to gain control and manage these costs. One solution? InfoSwitch LDCS, our long-distance control system. For companies spending $5,000 or more monthly in long-distance charges, InfoSwitch LDCS has proven itself a winner, cutting long-distance costs from 15 to 50 percent through least cost routing and optimization of line usage. In addition to dramatic cost reductions, LDCS breaks out communications expenses by individual, by duration, by corporation. This allows management the flexibility to design new rules to limit or expand communication expenses. 
A second problem, how to manage costs in major metropolitan areas charging for local exchange calls. A second solution, InfoSwitch Station Message Detail Recorder, SMDR. A system that records calls by user station, duration of call, and produces management reports which reflect number of calls, call length, destination, and cost. This system reduces abuse by employees and provides management with information on an increasingly important segment of their telecommunications costs. A combined LDCS SMDR system provides total control over all outbound calling. We designed our InfoSwitch Share system specifically to answer the problems faced by multi-location companies. Share provides centralized management control over telecommunications activities for as many as eight sites and produces reports for each site and the corporation as a whole. But telecommunications problems don't only involve outbound calling. Companies handling large volumes of incoming calls faced yet another problem. How to track those calls, evaluate agent performance, and improve customer service at the same time. Our InfoSwitch automatic call distributor is the answer for incoming call control. ACD provides management with information like number of calls offered, number of calls answered, how long the customer had to wait, and level of agent performance. A great service to companies like airlines, banks, insurance companies, newspapers. In short, any business that depends on incoming calls on a day-to-day -day basis. All of the InfoSwitch systems function separately, but now with ARC, other telecommunication systems can be integrated, joined together to increase flexibilities, applications, capabilities, and reduce costs. That's where ARC comes in. InfoSwitch ARC allows businesses of any size to enjoy the processing power of a large computer by using smaller, functionally dispersed computers. Let's examine the components that make up the InfoSwitch ARC system. The attached resource computer system contains two types of processors. The applications processor designed to accomplish the entry and processing of data unique to an application, and the file processor dedicated to supplying and managing data that is to be accessed and used by the applications processor. All data is stored on magnetic disk files, and the number of processors and disks is determined solely by the needs of your company. All processors are connected by a high-speed electronic pathway, or bus. This inter-processor bus allows communication among all the separate components, welding them into one very adaptable computing system. A primary benefit of the InfoSwitch ARC is that it places the computing power where people need it throughout the corporation without demanding vast expenditures for standalone equipment. A company need not face overcapacity or undercapacity when installing an ARC system. Because unlike other systems, ARC grows item by item or by modular unit, making it easy to branch into varied tasks without redesigning the system. ARC's modular growth potential provides a system any size business can live with, and more importantly, grow with. Should your company need more applications capability, simply add another applications processor. Should more storage be needed, attach additional disk drives. For faster data access, just add on a file processor. In no case do you have to rewrite programs or is other software necessary. ARC provides a common database. This means that all users on the bus can have access to the same information without maintaining duplicate data and any portion of the common database can be easily restricted from use at any time. InfoSwitch ARC is the next natural step toward effective office communication in the future. For example, a customer with an LDCS wants to add an ACD system. When integrated with ARC, certain duplicate equipment such as a file could be eliminated. The ability to exchange information between systems allows the acquisition of the ACD system without adding another underutilized file. The user achieves added flexibility to run applications on another low-cost applications processor, which also can provide backup. The ARC system is reliable, 
Unlike other computer systems that depend on one main unit for all data processing and distribution, the ARC system uses several processors. Because the processing load is distributed among these individual units, the failure of one computer does not result in disaster. Failures, when they do occur, do not bring the entire system to a standstill. Tasks of the failed processor can be reassigned, keeping information moving smoothly until the failed component is repaired or replaced. In addition to the actual equipment or hardware of the InfoSwitch ARC system, special software or service packages are available. The directory package provides companies with the ability to constantly have an up-to-date telephone directory of employees by name, department, employee number, primary and secondary extension number, and mail station. The directory itself is produced by the systems printer in a form suitable for offset printing and distribution. This package consolidates information and makes cross-referencing easy through alphabetical, departmental, or mail station listings. Another software package available through ARC is the equipment billing package. This package gives a complete inventory of telephone equipment. The great advantage of the equipment billing package is that it allows a company to bill individuals or departments for actual equipment usage. It simplifies record keeping and ensures that inventory is kept up to date and accurate. The lack of information on how well a company's telecommunications system is utilized led DataPoint to offer the Network Optimizer. The network optimizer examines the different costs and utilization of available telecommunications facilities like watts, foreign exchange, and tie lines. It provides management with recommendations as to what combination and number of lines best fits their needs. The network optimizer, in effect, periodically fine-tunes a company's communication system, helping to make it more efficient and less costly. But how does ARC fit with other systems? ARC is compatible with all data point computer and telecommunications systems. It is easily integrated with existing dispersed data processing systems. ARC allows businesses to enjoy the full benefit of a large computer system while avoiding the traditional cost and operational drawbacks. ARC is task oriented. It is flexible. It is easily upgraded and provides an easy growth path with no economic penalty. ARC virtually eliminates downtime due to total system failure. And because the system is built by DataPoint, it's backed by experienced customer service representatives in over 100 cities nationwide. DataPoint will continue to lead the field in communications management, providing business with logical, cost-efficient solutions to communications problems. ARC systems are already being used successfully in industries around the country, like public accounting, insurance, banking, and stock brokerage firms. Listed on the New York Stock Exchange, DataPoint is in a strong financial position and will continue to develop new systems, answer new questions, and provide increasing services. DataPoint also leases its products, offering an additional alternative to the user. So there you have it, the office of today. Non-integrated elements functioning separately from one another at higher cost. And then there's InfoSwitch Arc, the vehicle for merging voice and data. The first step toward an integrated electronic office. DataPoint Corporation has been providing innovative solutions to office problems for over a decade. DataPoint has been the leader in introducing sophisticated dispersed data processing systems which put computer processing power out where it is used in a corporation. To meet the need for efficient generation and mailing of documents, word processing and the electronic message system capabilities have been added to the capabilities of many of our existing processors. 
Data Point has also incorporated sophisticated information storage and retrieval features in all systems to ensure that a company's valuable information will always be at their fingertips. But Data Point has also been uniquely successful in meeting the needs of business in an area that many other computer companies have never approached. Communications management. For a century, voice communications has been regarded as a fixed expense. Most businesses have simply accepted telephone costs as an unalterable fact of life. More and more, that idea is being exploded as a myth, and telecommunications is being regarded increasingly as a powerful management tool and an opportune area for cost reduction and cash savings. Since 1975, DataPoint has been providing the systems necessary for corporations to control and reduce voice communications costs. Today, DataPoint offers a full-featured family of communications management products. These products supply corporate management with active control over voice communication and hard information about telecommunications cost and line utilization. These features enable a corporation to use their telecommunication system as a management tool to run their businesses more efficiently and economically. Initially, DataPoint attacked the voice communications area where the need for control was greatest, long distance. In the past, long distance has been characterized by a lack of control which would not be tolerated in areas of equal corporate expense. Most businesses lack vital information on facility usage, cost allocation, and call detail. The traditional methods used to access long-distance lines are generally inefficient. The need for in-house operator long-distance assistance is an unnecessary manpower expense. And compounding these problems, the cost of long-distance continues to rise at a rapid rate. DataPoint offers a cost-effective solution to these problems, the LDCS, Long Distance Control System. The LDCS is an intelligent telephone switching system providing a wide array of features, such as sophisticated least cost routing, dial access by individual caller identity number, complete systems management and accounting reports, as well as other special features enabling the user to reduce and account for his monthly long distance cost. Let's examine these features a bit more closely. Least cost routing. Least cost routing is a powerful feature of DataPoint's LDCS, which relieves a company of the inefficiency and wasted money involved in manually selecting and accessing long distance lines. With least cost routing, your LDCS automatically routes calls over the lowest cost line available, including flat rate and DDD facilities. Having defined a caller's priority via his caller identity number, the LDCS will automatically select the optimal series of lines for the call, thus relieving the caller of that decision. If the lowest cost line type is busy, the system will check the identity number and either select a higher cost line or queue the call for a short period of time until the least costly line becomes available. Because the long distance control system is an intelligent switching system, decisions about individual priority, line selection, and line access are handled at extremely high speeds, dramatically reducing the amount of time spent waiting for a line. An example of how the LDCS handles a specific long distance call presents a clear picture of how this sophisticated system operates. You begin by contacting the long distance control system through entering an access number, say, 88. Once the system is contacted, a brief tone is heard. You enter your three to six digit identity number, and a dial tone will indicate the number's acceptance, and you enter the long distance number you want to call. At this point, the LDCS looks up the area code, and if further instructed, the exchange code of your call and checks a routing table automatically selecting the optimum line for your long distance call. The LDCS routing table is a pre-programmed sequence of line selections defined by the user and stored in the system's host processor. This routes a call over a specific series of least cost lines determined by factors such as line facilities, identity number, time of day, day of week, and call destination. Once the line has been selected, the system will redial the number at electronic speeds, eliminating many user dialing mistakes and delays on the more expensive long distance facilities. This feature alone results in saving an average of 30 seconds per call.
This represents wasted watts line time in a conventional system that cost you money. For numbers frequently called, such as district offices or major customers, the LDCS provides speed numbers. A three or five digit abbreviation reduces manual dialing time and is a major convenience feature for users. The least cost routing function of DataPoint's LDCS packs calls on the most inexpensive lines possible and gets maximum usage from these lines. Let's examine least cost routing via a typical routing table. Say your company employs a PBX configured with foreign exchange lines to a major office in a distant city and a series of full business watts lines. Having entered the system access code, your identity number, and the calls number, the system immediately recognizes the call can be completed by a foreign exchange line. The system selects the foreign exchange three line. If this line is occupied, the system will seek a full business day band one watts. If neither of these lowest cost lines are free, the system will put the call in a short queue. This call holding pattern is a powerful feature of the LDCS. The pattern's use and length can be set to meet users' needs with hold times ranging from five seconds to several minutes. On average, a call is held for 20 seconds, waiting for a preferred line to clear. If after 20 seconds the lines are still occupied, the system will continue on to the full business day band 5 watts. If that is in use, the system will hold your call for an additional 30 seconds, consistently checking for any of these lines to open up. This is called multi-stage queuing and is unique to the LDCS. If all lines were still in use after this time, and if your ID priority allows, the system could overflow your call into more expensive lines. In addition, a very high priority ID code can be given to certain employees that allows immediate call placement without queuing. For certain callers, an option will be defined in a user's identity number which will allow callback queuing. With callback queuing, the system immediately determines if a low-cost line is open. If not, four options exist. If the call was not vital, the caller can simply hang up and try again at a later time. If callback is desired, the user can dial zero, instructing the system to call back at the user's normal extension, which is stored in the ID database, as soon as a line is opened. If a caller will not be at his desk phone, a two to five digit code can be used to direct the system to the extension where he can be contacted. Or if the call is important, it can bypass the callback point and be placed over higher cost lines if available. Because the system is computerized, the search for open lines is accomplished at high speeds. During peak traffic times, the system can reconfigure itself to take advantage of different routing tables, caller privileges or restrictions and rate changes. The system can also activate and deactivate certain facilities to ease the load. The long distance control system was designed with the flexibility to handle the unique long distance needs of a customer's company. Caller identity number. In most companies, because no priorities exist among users, line usage exists on a first-come, first-served basis. With many employees believing a company's flat rate lines are essentially free, executives who need to utilize these lines for vital business have no assurance that a line will be available. When you can't get a line, it's even more frustrating to know that some lines are probably being used for personal or non-business calls. The long distance control system's priority feature ensures that those with a high priority will have access to lines and also helps reduce non-business calls. Employees requiring access to the company's long distance lines are assigned a caller identity number. With this number, the LDCS is automatically aware of the degree of access available to the specific caller. A company determines the long distance needs of specific employees and a three to six digit code is assigned to the individual. This code informs the system of any restrictions in the use of long distance lines. For instance, an accounting clerk who may use long distance to retrieve information from other divisions within the state will be issued a lower range priority number. This number will restrict the person to intrastate Watts lines with no access to interstate lines. On the other hand, the company's national sales manager could be assigned a high priority number, which would not only afford him access to all flat rate lines, but allow him, when necessary, to overflow to the more expensive facilities, such as direct distance dialing lines. An additional benefit offered by the LDCS is remote access. 
Depending on the individual's identity number, he may access the company's long-distance facilities from any remote tone dial phone. This is accomplished simply by calling a number dedicated to give direct access to the company's LDCS, then entering your caller identity number and dialing the number wanted. This call will be entered into the system's accounting reports and serves to eliminate more expensive third-party or credit card calls. Priority numbers can be revised easily by the LDCS systems manager if an individual's calling needs change. Management and accounting reports. A company not currently employing a computerized telephone management system may realize their long-distance costs are high and escalating rapidly, but without relevant accounting and line management information, they are unable to construct a plan to exercise control or adequately forecast future needs. To meet this need for information, the LDCS offers a wide range of management and accounting reports aimed at helping companies gain control of all aspects of their long-distance system. For instance, the Traffic Data Analysis Report offers a graphic representation of traffic flow during a 24-hour period. Periods of peak usage are represented graphically and statistically. From this report, a business might decide to realign calling patterns. For instance, have collection clerks make their calls in early morning and late afternoon to even out the calling pattern and utilize lines in the most economical manner. A report on line utilization presents information on all flat rate lines as well as direct distance dialing trunks. Utilization is described by number of calls and their duration over each line. Without this type of information, a business has no way of knowing whether they are receiving the optimum performance from their lines or if they may be paying for more lines than necessary. This report also helps the user spot and diagnose line problems quickly, improving operation and reducing downtime on these lines. The call activity summary provides a guidepost for system operation. By providing a statistical overview of all long distance calls made in a 24 hour period, management can easily check the efficiency of the system's call handling. The cost savings derived from optimizing your long distance system are dramatically reflected in the accounting reports provided by the system. Call data on date, time, number called, location called, duration, and specific cost can be broken down by division, cost center, group, individuals, and projects. In the past, in order to compile accounting information on flat rate lines, toll tickets had to be manually logged or a specific request had to be made to your telephone company to provide call detail. Toll ticketing involved considerable manpower and receiving information from the telephone company took weeks or even months. With the LDCS reports, a company receives the kind of timely cost and usage detail never before possible. For companies which bill back telephone costs to clients, the LDCS will provide accounting reports by project code, simply and quickly. DataPoint's LDCS also allows the user to format his own reports. Managers can request and receive specific long-distance information, such as which employees during the past month made over $100 worth of calls. Format reports can provide management with the specific and unique calling information they desire to run their business more effectively. By making a corporation's telecommunications dollar go farther, the LDCS certainly justifies its existence on a standalone basis. But, like all data point products, the LDCS was designed to integrate with ARC, the attached resource computer. ARC is a physically dispersed, totally integrated computer system that places computer power where needed throughout a business. ARC allows for easy expansion by building upon existing equipment. If additional applications are necessary, simply add an application processor. If additional storage is needed, disk drives can be added. ARC's modular architecture and common database ensures a business need never face overcapacity or undercapacity. The attached resource computer offers a business the framework for integrating previously separate office functions, such as data processing, filing, mailing, word processing, and voice communications, thus providing the foundation for the integrated electronic office. A wide variety of software packages is available to the ARC user. In the field of communications management, DataPoint offers the telephone directory package and the equipment billing package. DataPoint's telephone directory package provides a company with an up-to-the-minute telephone directory. Information on caller identity number, extension, department, and location of each employee is compiled within the system and may be upgraded online. 
The telephone directory package improves the efficiency of corporate directory assistance by displaying requested information on the operator's terminal screen. The system will produce a camera-ready hard copy from which multiple copies can be printed for distribution to all employees within a company. The equipment billing package furnishes a communications manager with a complete inventory of a company's telephone equipment by individual, department, or division. Not only may individual equipment charges be billed back, but the use of shared equipment, such as the corporate PBX, can also be charged back proportionately. The equipment billing package not only produces reports on all telephone costs by individual departments, but reports are also produced on equipment supplied by each vendor, including anticipated charges based on equipment in inventory, plus all completed billable work orders. Both the telephone directory package and equipment billing package are valuable tools for the communications manager requiring up-to-date information on telecommunications equipment, usage, and cost. With DataPoint's introduction of the electronic message system, the capabilities of the LDCS have been expanded further. The electronic message system, EMS, sends, routes, receives, and manages message flow between local or remote workstations. The electronic message system guarantees that your messages are not lost or delayed. You set the priority of a message, and the system ensures that the message arrives on time. Information is entered into the system only once, eliminating duplication of tasks. And because the information is always contained within the system, you need never again worry about lost messages. EMS provides message security. It allows you the option of encrypting sensitive information as well as offering delivery verification and acknowledgement of receipt. Management and accounting reports are provided which let you bill back all message costs and control this rapidly growing area of business expense. Beyond this, EMS is simple to learn and simple to use with a minimum amount of training required, an important consideration for any business. The LDCS, in conjunction with the network controller of the electronic message system, can interleave voice and message traffic to remote sites. Messages are sent over flat rate facilities between voice conversations and during non-peak voice traffic periods of the day or overnight. This interleaving further optimizes the use of flat rate lines and provides message delivery for free or for an extremely small incremental cost. With the ability to transmit message communication as well as voice communication, DataPoint's LDCS becomes even more instrumental in meeting a company's total communications needs. As with long distance, businesses face many problems involving local toll calls. Many major metropolitan areas now charge for local calls. Though cost per call or message unit may be considered small, at the end of the month this figure can prove to be a considerable factor in a company's phone bill. Local phone companies provide no hard information on either facility usage or accounting information needed to bring down cost. DataPoint's solution to this problem is the SMDR, Station Message Detail Recorder. The SMDR is an intelligent metering subsystem which reports and records all calling activity. Reports provided by the SMDR supply information on user, destination, number, duration, time of day, date, and cost for all outgoing local calls. These reports help to reduce personal or unauthorized calling by extending user accountability to local calling. Specifics on lines and facility utilization and traffic data allow management to correct inefficiencies within the system. An important feature of SMDR is automatic station identification. This eliminates the need for individual users to manually enter a caller identity number. All station numbers and any priority restrictions are already contained within the system. Since the automatic station identification function is defined by the user, a station's priority may be revised at any time. An SMDR in conjunction with the LDCS can provide a company with total control over all local and long distance calls and represents another method of further reducing telecommunications costs. Let's consider one more communications problem in which the LDCS can play a vital role. Multi-location companies need to benefit from least cost routing and the other features of the LDCS and SMDR, but frequently cannot justify a separate system and communications professional at each field site. 
data point saw the need for a centralized system that would enable the home office to monitor caller activity line usage and costs for their remote offices the data point share system offers centralized control for any combination of up to eight ldcs and or smdr subsystems located around the country these subsystems handle the details of actual call placement while the system management and accounting reports are controlled by the share host processor in the home office. None of the benefits of either the LDCS or SMDR are lost, and the information gained through centralized management of these systems allows multi-location companies a degree of centralized control over their telecommunication network never before available. Datapoint has designed all of its communications management products to be turnkey, hardware, software, and interface provided by Datapoint with no user programming required. These systems may all function on a standalone basis or can be integrated with other Datapoint systems. They're easy to install and simple to use with a minimal amount of training required. All Datapoint products are supported by our nationwide network of over 160 customer service offices staffed by over 700 trained service representatives. Datapoint's customer service center, headquartered in San Antonio, Texas, compiles a complete history on each site, and with our toll-free number, support is available 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Since 1969, Datapoint's strategy has been to improve office productivity by offering modular computing systems with the capabilities of integrating all office functions. This strategy has placed Datapoint in a solid financial position. Listed on the New York Stock Exchange and in Fortunes 1000, Datapoint has seen a 47% per year compounded growth rate over the last five years. The Datapoint Corporation will continue to provide the systems necessary to improve efficiency and increase productivity in the office. LDCS, SMDR, Share, ARC, to control, manage, and reduce the cost of outbound calls. have come to rely heavily upon the telephone for business transactions. Its convenience and universal acceptance as a medium for business communication make it an indispensable tool for a wide variety of industries. In fact, many companies whose business is comprised almost exclusively of telephone transactions would find it impossible to get along without the telephone. For example, how else could newspapers manage a large volume of classified advertising without phone-in service? How could airlines possibly handle their reservations? And how could customer-oriented service companies respond quickly and decisively to customer complaints? The answer to all these questions is simple. Without efficient telephone call handling, companies in these and many other industries would be hard-pressed to provide adequate service to their clients. But as the size and complexity of telephone-oriented business applications increase, so do the difficulties in keeping telephone operations streamlined and efficient. This, this is Sam Crowther with Western Hardware. We just purchased one of your air conditioning systems, and we're having a little bit of problem with it. It seems to be leaking all over. I'm sorry, sir, but this is the switchboard. Oh. Would you 
you like to speak to someone in the service department? Yes, I'll be happy to talk with someone in your service department if I get... Just a moment. Hello, this, this is Sam Crowther with Western Hardware. We just purchased one of your systems over here, and I need some service on it. It's springing leaks all over the building, and... I'm sorry, sir, but I can't help you with that right now. Our... If you can't help me, who can? Well, sir, I think you'd need to speak to my supervisor about this, but I'm afraid... If I need to talk to the supervisor, then let me talk to him. But he's not in the building right now. You mean he's not in the building? You mean that I can't talk to anybody over there about the leaks we're having in this building? I'm, I'm sorry, sir, but it's just that... Well... Sometimes inefficient telephone service is worse than no service at all, for it can result in damaged customer relations. How many potential customers may your business have lost due to inefficient call handling? How much has this cost you in lost revenue? Unfortunately for most companies, the answer to these questions is difficult, if not impossible, to come by. And this is the major problem faced by modern businesses. Without a system for managing call handling activity, there's no accurate way to guarantee that customers are getting the service they deserve in return for the business these companies need. What businesses need is a low-cost method for knowing how many calls come in during business hours, how many calls are lost due to inefficient handling how the density of incoming calls may vary throughout the day, and most important, how to distribute these calls fairly among the available personnel in order to produce the best possible service. In response to these growing needs, DataPoint Corporation, the leader in communications management, offers the InfoSwitch Automatic Call Distributor, a low-cost addition to a company's existing telephone facilities that provides Optimize distribution and handling of incoming telephone calls, including more efficient management of the telephone agents themselves. Accounting information for bill back of chargeable incoming calls to those departments responsible for them. And the ability to process simultaneously both incoming and outgoing calls from the same agent position. Just what is the InfoSwitch automatic call distributor? It's a fully featured intelligent telephone management system. Based on the proven engineering of DataPoint's communications management and business computing products, the InfoSwitch ACD is a flexible, economical answer to these complex problems in telecommunications. The InfoSwitch automatic call distributor is designed to process large volumes of both incoming and outgoing telephone calls. It works side by side with existing telephone facilities such as Watts, foreign exchange, tie lines, and local exchanges. Through its ability to distinguish among these facilities on the basis of their business function, the InfoSwitch ACD gives the effect of being several independent call distribution systems in one. These lines may be divided up according to their usage by the company into divisions called splits. These splits are the basis for the ACD's ability to distribute calls to their destination without human intervention. By assigning an individualized routing table to each line split, the company telecommunications manager can completely automate the process of incoming call distribution. In addition, agent lines may be divided into groups according to their specialized functions. For instance, a bank might designate several different agent groups corresponding to the loan department, new accounts, and so on. Each group would then receive only those types of calls for which they'd been prepared, eliminating wasted call time and customer aggravation. Let's take a closer look at the ways in which the InfoSwitch automatic call distributor's routing tables are used to define the path of an incoming call. A potential customer for a new bank account dials the new accounts number found in the telephone directory. This number would typically be either a local or foreign exchange. When the call reaches the InfoSwitch ACD, it is identified as belonging to that group of lines designated as Split 3. The ACD retrieves from memory the routing table associated with that split placed there earlier by the bank's telecommunications manager. It then proceeds along the following series of steps. First, the ACD checks to see if an agent from Group 3 is available to take the call. If so, InfoSwitch connects the caller to that agent. If more than one agent is available, the ACD assigns the call according to user-determined guidelines, which ensure fair and equal distribution of work among all of the agents. If an agent from Group 3 is not available, the call continues to ring for up to 15 seconds. 
at which time the ACD will answer the call and give a delay announcement. I'm sorry, but all of my telephone agents are busy at the moment. Please stand by and you'll be connected with the first available agent. Thank you. After this announcement has been given, the ACD will hold the call for an additional 30 seconds, checking continuously to see if an agent from Group 3 has become free. A music on hold step can be used to instruct the ACD to play pre-recorded music during this and all subsequent holds. If an agent from Group 3 is still not available after this time, the ACD searches another agent group, Group 9. This transfer of a search from one agent group to another within the same ACD is known as intraflow. If an agent from Group 9 is available, the ACD immediately makes the connection, but first delivers a message that only the agent can hear. New accounts. Thus, the agent is prepared before receiving a call from another agent group. If an agent from Group 9 is not available, the info switch will continue to search Groups 3 and 9 for agents until one is free. Music will continue to be played until the connection is completed. Routing tables may vary according to the specific needs of companies and their agent groups. Up to 15 different steps may be assigned to a given routing table, with holding times ranging from 5 to 60 seconds. A second or third announcement may follow the first and can even be in different languages for different line splits. What's more, a company with two or more InfoSwitch ACDs can also route an interflow call to agents at another ACD if all of the local possibilities have already been exhausted. This can be especially useful after business hours when all incoming calls can be routed to one ACD for special after hours handling. With these and other features, companies can use the InfoSwitch ACD to build call distribution systems that are custom tailored to the needs of their employees and customers. And yet this customization requires no knowledge of computer programming techniques. Another problem faced by call processing centers that handle a large volume of incoming calls stems from the instruments which the agents must currently use. In most situations, the telephone lines monitored by the agent group all terminate on every agent's instrument. These telephone key sets provide buzzers and flashing lights to announce incoming calls and are operated by depressing the appropriate button. It's impossible using these instruments to process calls fairly because it's impossible to determine which callers have been waiting the longest for service. The InfoSwitch ACD eliminates these problems with its specially designed agent instrument. Housed in an attractive, sturdy case, the ACD instrument is equipped with a variety of useful function keys. These keys further enhance operator efficiency by reducing the call answering process to its simplest possible level. Let's examine the operation of this instrument more closely through a typical example of its use. Springfield Herald Classifieds. May I help you? Yes. I'd like to place an ad in this Sunday's paper. All right. What column would you like that in? The agent notified InfoSwitch that she was at her position by entering her unique agent code. Then, simply by touching the ready key, she signified that she was available to receive her first call. When the automatic call distributor assigned the call, it first informed her of the city from which the call originated, because regional editions of her newspaper charge different rates for advertising. Let me read that back to you, Mr. Morrow. By making her job as simple as possible, the InfoSwitch ACD allows the agent to devote most of her attention to her customer, ensuring the best possible service. That'll appear in the Sunday paper. Thank you very much. Another key allows the agent to remain undisturbed by calls while completing any follow-up paperwork that may be necessary after the call. When she finishes with that, the ready key again signals her availability to the ACD. Springfield Herald Classifieds, may I help you? The InfoSwitch ACD keeps a complete record of the agent's time, including total time spent talking to callers, time spent in after-call wrap-up, whether the call is incoming or outgoing, time of day and duration of call, and so on. 
This performance can also be gauged online during working hours by the agent supervisor. The InfoSwitch provides up to 15 supervisor consoles which present dynamic, up-to-the-minute displays on call handling operations. The supervisor's console describes the status of every agent position under the responsibility of that supervisor, such as whether or not a position is occupied, which step of the call answering process an agent is currently working on, and whether or not any unusual conditions apply, such as a request for the supervisor to join a call in progress. In addition to displaying information about the agent force, the supervisor's console also shows the condition of incoming calls, how many calls are waiting for agents, whether delays are within tolerable limits, and other information crucial to efficient operations. With this information, a supervisor can easily determine if the agent force is adequate to keep pace with the incoming call activity. Since the average frequency of incoming calls is a matter of record on the InfoSwitch ACD, the supervisor can plan ahead to meet increased or decreased demands without guesswork. But answering incoming calls is only one of many contingencies faced by this type of agent force. Suppose, for instance, an agent needs to transfer a call. You want to discuss that with the commercial ad editor. Just a moment, please. Commercial ad. Charlie, could you discuss commercial ad placement with this gentleman, please? Sure, put him on. Thank you. It's as simple as the push of a button. Agents can also retain a call on hold, initiate another call, and connect all three parties in a conference call with no more difficulty than this. So let me connect my supervisor. Just a moment. Nancy, would you help me handle this call, please? Sure, put him on. Sir, my supervisor's on the line with us. Through the versatility of this instrument, an agent can deal effortlessly with nearly any contingency that may arise, and with such ease that the agent can be trained to use it in a matter of minutes. The InfoSwitch ACD is also designed to aid in originating and processing a large volume of outgoing calls, such as might be generated in a telephone marketing company. No separate PBX or Centrex extensions to the agent positions are required. The agents themselves may have access to any of the outgoing telephone facilities which their supervisors designate. For example, an agent needing to make frequent contact with service representatives in the field would be allowed access to the Watts and Foreign Exchange lines by the ACD. On the other hand, a reservations agent would generally require no long-distance access. Therefore, the info switch would restrict this agent's calls to those made locally. Once again, the versatility of the InfoSwitch agent instrument makes dialing as simple as possible. It also allows an agent to initiate a call while holding another call already being handled. It is this combination of computer-based telephone management and simple agent operations that makes the InfoSwitch automatic call distributor one of the most flexible systems available anywhere. Whether your business telephone application revolves around incoming call handling, outgoing call origination, or some of each, the InfoSwitch ACD can be tailored directly to your needs. The InfoSwitch ACD provides an extensive array of management information reports, which can be produced at specified intervals or upon demand. These reports are hard copy analyses of how each agent using the ACD has performed, the overall volume of activity in the system, with totals and averages broken down by line splits. How each of the lines within a given split have been utilized, together with which types of facilities have drawn the highest usage. And the activity of each group as a whole, for use in analyzing traffic loads and staffing response. With reports such as these, a company's telecommunications manager can know in detail the degree to which the system is functioning efficiently. This can often result in more effective allocation of line types, staff, and budget. Not only does this mean faster, more reliable service to customers, resulting in better business, but it also represents direct out-of-pocket savings, usually enough to pay for the InfoSwitch system itself in a short time. And the info switch can grow as your company grows. Through the building block approach to system configuration, additional agent groups, additional lines, and other info switch ACDs can be joined to an existing facility to keep pace with even the fastest growth. Let's take a look at the hardware features that can make this upward growth possible.
The central processing unit at the heart of every InfoSwitch ACD is a data point manufactured computer. Advanced business computers like this have revolutionized the use of computers in business through their compact size, ease of operation, and wide capability. This computer is supported by cartridge disk memory for storage of agent identification files, time of day route definitions, and for storage of call accounting detail for historical analysis and cost allocation. The other portion of the system is an intelligent controller. This drives a high reliability read relay switching matrix and telephone trunk scanner. It is the micro-programmed controller within this system that actually controls the ACD's line handling subfunctions. Other peripheral equipment for the InfoSwitch ACD includes any of several data point local printers operating from 80 characters per second to 600 lines per minute for hard copy reports, and optionally an industry standard magnetic tape drive for physical transfer of accounting data to another computer system. And the economical pricing of InfoSwitch places practical telephone management within reach of most medium-sized companies. A small InfoSwitch ACD with all of the features described here can be leased for as little as $2,500 a month. A variety of purchase and leasing plans are available to meet the financial needs of nearly any company. The automatic call distributor is just one of the InfoSwitch family of products. Through its commitment to telecommunications management for business, DataPoint has engineered a proven product capability that extends from automatic call distribution and management to control of long distance telephone usage, to call detail recording on all telephones in a company, to a multiple site info switch that allows a company's branch offices to share these benefits. Let InfoSwitch's proven performance show you why DataPoint remains the leader in communications management.